I'm going to quickly show you how to edit the manhole network properties and the conduit network properties. So this allows us to edit multiple manholes at the same time and multiple conduits at the same time. To do this, we go to the drainage tools and click on the manhole network properties to begin with and select the network that we actually want to choose. So in this case, it's this connected network. And this will show us all of the manholes that are connected to that one that we selected there. So then what we can do now is use the um, left click to select items and we can use the shift and control key. So if I hit the shift and select another manhole, it'll select all the ones in between. And we can use the control key to then um, select others as we go, as you'd normally be used to. So from here, we can then edit value and all the manholes that are selected when I press return or press enter will then update as we go. So you, those manholes have now increased in size and we can change uh, a, a variety of different things here. So I could say that they're all private and you can see those colors have also changed because they've gone to the private type and things like that. Click OK and it'll accept all those options here. The uh, conduit network properties is very similar. We select the connected network and it'll show us all of the pipes in that connected network. And then we can use the same uh, multiple selections. Uh, so hold down the shift key to select from one to another. You can see it'll select all of them like that. And we can change all the variety uh, or all the properties in here. So we can click on the uh, colors again and hit pick. And in this case, I'm just gonna set the entirety of run one to yellow. And you can see that has now done it in the background here. Click okay and it's accepted that and we now have run one highlighted in yellow for the conduits. And that's how we would change multiple manholes and conduits at the same time in Site3D. Thank you.